Hey you guys, how y'all doing? It's Les Chat with Miss D. Hey, got my clone twin here. We are going to give some unsolicited advice on the Fox Soul crew, uh, Claudia Jordan, Armand Wiggins, and Al Reynolds. We gonna get it in, y'all, okay? For those of you who don't know, you have, uh, I'll be watching Fox Soul and Al Reynolds got roasted for his birthday. I think that was a personal roast. I just don't view that as, oh, just a regular roast. Okay, today that we're celebrating our very own Al Reynolds birthday. Al, you're a man of many talents. Some of which include being messy, causing drama, and having a knack for making our workplace feel like a reality TV show. Al's got a unique ability to smile in your face, snap a picture, and go behind your back and talk about your co talk about you to your coworker that he say that he claims he hates. It's like he's got a PhD in two faced study. Uh, okay. Uh, uh. Due to Al's special relationship with management and his hypersensitivity, we are not allowed to talk about his failed marriage. So even uh -huh. though he's brought it up many times, I'll steer clear of that topic to keep my job. Now, but wait, uh -huh. there's more. Al fancies himself as the facts guy. But somehow he never seems to get the actual facts right. He oh. also he's also a talk show host who's supposed to have all the strong opinions, but the guy can't form a thought without his notes. Oh. Very quickly, I've seen grocery store lists with more spontaneous insight. And let's not forget his legendary struggle with names and words. Al, it's successful, not successful. It's like watching a toddler trying to pronounce spaghetti. Oh, and uh -huh. how can I forget Al's clout chasing antics? He's got all these celebrities' friends, but the best part, none of these celebrities actually know they're supposed to be friends with him. Ooh. And as if that wasn't enough. Al is currently on a mission to get our talk show canceled. His nasty child is slightly jealous attitude is working overtime to torpedo our show. It's like he's auditioning for a soap opera villain role. But despite all the chaos, let's not forget it's your <laughs> birthday, Al. Okay, so here's to you. May your future be as drama free as your past has been drama filled. Happy birthday, y'all! Well, I believe that um, uh, Amon, he roasted out like he was not coming back on the job. That's what he did. I'm like, oh my God, Miss, really? Are you going there? You might not be coming back tomorrow. Let me say this. Amon went in. And that's probably how he do things, but I don't think so. That that to me it seems kinda personal. It really did. I mean he went all the way in. And he probably studied exactly what he was gonna say. He probably has based it off of all the interaction that he had with uh, Al Reynolds. You never know. Because you know what? You have people who pretend as though you guys are cordial. Oh, we can work in the uh, same spot. We can work in the same spot because I don't really have to see him like that. I can talk to him. He's not my friend, though. But, hey, it is what it is. But when he did that roast, a mom went in. And I like to see how this all pans out. They're not in the same space. But they're trying to get syndicated and the numbers are not numbering at all they're not we're gonna see how this go on monday it's gonna be a hot mess situation good i just think that somebody gonna get fired because this this this, this how it happens on jobs you know when you making the company look bad like that and y'all ain't doing numbers you gotta be doing numbers in order to make the company look like that. But, um, or maybe, or maybe it's to get folks to talk. You think that's what it is? Because that guy Al, he went on, uh, 
uh, did one show. They were saying that he went on this one show, did one guy show, and he was like, I don't give a damn, they can hear it. The guy was trying to tell him that you lie, and he didn't even give a hoot. He was trying to say that he was live, and he was like, well, I don't give a damn, I don't give a He didn't care. And I'm thinking, well, if that what they saying, is it a possibility that uh, they were just trying to get their numbers up? They trying to get people out there to start talking. That's what they trying to do. They trying to get them people out there to talking. I don't know. Sounds suspect. It really does. But they ain't doing no numbers over there on that fight show. So, hey, that show probably need to be canceled. Probably do. You know, because when you bring drama to the channel, it pumps up the numbers. Let's see what it do on Monday. If it pump up the numbers, if it don't pump up the numbers, then they gonna pump you up out of there. That's what I gotta say about that. I don't know, girl. But thank you for bringing me on your channel, let chat with me, D. And let me talk and say what I had to talk about. Because it get ridiculous out there with some of this stuff that's going on out there. And I wouldn't mind coming back to give my unsolicited opinion like you say. Okay? Yeah. Thank you, girl. Well, I tell y'all what. Um, in that audio, um, <laughs> I mean, really some roasting going on. Al cannot tell me that he wasn't angry. And come to find out, um, I think the channel that Al went on, it was a Funky Dineva channel. He went on his channel and he expressed how he feel. But it was kind of weird to me. It made me think like it was a skit or something. I don't know. Because if Funky Dineva is saying to you, hey, uh, I'm live, I'm live, and you saying what you don't care, they need to hear this live and this, that, and other, apparently you must be watching because you said to Funky Dineva, oh, you got me on live? Okay, ain't that what he told you? Are you being special? You trying to sit in the middle of the bus or the back of the bus? I don't know. Anywho, um, Al just, just, I don't know. You kind of out there, brother. You kind of out there. But hopefully uh, they can get it together. Hopefully it's not a skit. Uh, I don't know. It kind of seemed like it may be a skit or something like that to up... To boost those numbers because you know when folks try to start talking about folks it draws traction to that channel and that's why I say I don't know if that's a skit or what but hopefully you guys can get those numbers up and uh, don't get canceled just hope so